about him. Father, we thank you for this time of service with the song, the prayer that was worshipped this morning and this afternoon. We pray that something will be said and done, a heart will be touched, a need will be met, a sickness will be healed and delivered. There will be signs, wonders, and miracles here this day. Even if we we'll conclude this service, you receive all honor, all glory, all praises in your great name. Amen. You can be seated. Amen. Amen. Oh, oh, Lord have mercy. Woo, thank you, thank you. Uh, I give honor to Pastor First Christ, my Savior, and to all the clergy, all the people, God, and position you have in church with green greetings this afternoon. It's a hot day, isn't it? But guess what? If you don't live right, no place is hotter than this. <laughs> Can't ask for no ice water. Amen. No air condition. Another thing will work. Amen. I'm glad to be here this afternoon. It's been a long time. I think the prophet said, I haven't seen you in a while. I've been busy. After my pastor, a year and a half, back to my uh, home church. And uh, after that, I've been hitting the street corners in the Bronx and the hat and round, preaching the, uh, the gospel of Jesus Christ. And I, they often like to sing the song, uh, Lord bless America. But I'm saying, why don't America bless God? Amen. Yeah. These are the last days, fearless times to come. And we're not talking about denomination, organization, affiliation, religion. We're talking about a living Savior. Amen, that has saved us and kept us in times like this. This is where we find out our salvation worked for us. And what God has kept us is these trying hours. Because the Bible does say the last days, perilous times shall come. And guess what? They're here. Amen. I care what you say. Amen. They're here. And so we thank God we are here. And we thank God is able to preserve us and keep us and bring us back again. We thank God for, again, Pastor and all the Saints to God to greet me today. Uh, I'm here and to worship with you and have praise with you. And soon this week, it ain't too, too hot. Amen. We hit the streets again. Amen. Yes. Uh, they tell the senior citizen, you know, when you're a certain age, stay out of the sun. Amen. When I look at some of the faces and things, a lot of you all need to stay out of the sun today. Amen. Amen. I, I take my shirt off. You see, my arm is all black here and white. Uh, right here, because I've been in the sunshine. God has blessed me so much to be witnessing highways, byways, streets, and especially on Hunts Point in Soundview. Hunts Point on 163rd Street, there's one of the church uh, bishops out there preaching from Monday to, to Friday uh, from 10 to 5 p.m., just making a, a noise to the Lord, and that's what it's all about, outside witness. So briefly today, Lord gave me this message. You're with me, you're not going to fall asleep, are you? Hello. All right, let's stretch up. Amen. In Gospel according to St. Luke, uh, eight chapter, Gospel of St. Luke, Matthew, Mark. I'm see, I'm running off the head. Mark. Mark 8 and 38. And I want to read that the message for you, to you today briefly. Don't uh, is there any word from the Lord? And this is what the Lord is giving to speak to you, not what I'm gonna preach in the street. But uh, what to say this to you. Can you just stand up? Just stand up as on a cut. Everyone stand up, please. Thank you. Just a verse. Mark 8 and 38. And it reads as this. Thus. Whosoever therefore shall be ashamed of me and of my words in this adulteress 
and sinful generation of him also shall the son of man be ashamed when he cometh into his glory. Amen. Read that again. Whosoever therefore shall be ashamed of me and of my words in this adulterous and sinful generation. Uh -huh. Is it a sinful generation? Yes. Yeah. Of him also the Son of Man shall be ashamed when he come in his what? In his glory of his Father with the holy angels. You may be seated. Amen. I want to use the thought briefly today from the subject, an unashamed Christian. Hello. Unashamed. Unashamed Christian. Paul said, I'm not ashamed. Romans 1 and 16, 17. I'm not ashamed of the gospel of what? Of Jesus Christ for his power unto salvation to everyone that believe it, to the Jew and also to the Greek. I, I, I've been saved at the age 21, getting out of the army career, and from the age of 21 saved, sanctified, filled with the Holy Ghost, up to age 21. 82 to 82 this year. And when I look how God has brought me out of combat, God has preserved me, drinking, smoking, chasing crazy women. Hello, thank you, Lord. And acting mad, bad, looking sad, drinking all the rough liquor and acting ugly and stupid. Amen. But by the grace of God, I would like much better, a little skinnier, you know, a little 120. But God saved me my last year in the army of Uncle Sam and then put me in this army. And this is why I'm not ashamed to go anywhere amen, amen, amen. without drinking and snapping your pocketbook and carrying two switchblades. Hello, they call me a rabbit because I can run fast. I still can run now. <laughs> I used to challenge a young cousin and young boy, show him how this 82 old Man can run. I can run fast. One day I can't maintain it. You know, they got to get out of breath. <laughs> There's something, buddy. Amen. Here in our text, here in our text, Jesus is speaking to the, the audience. He's addressing the good news, the living truth, the rhema, the living word. And he says something very important from the text. But if I read the, the text, says 38 said, Whosoever there shall be ashamed of me. And I, I can't understand how God has saved us, kept us. And when I see sometimes, and I knock you here this morning, but many churches, they're ashamed or scared or timid to testify in the church. Hello. Yes. Some testifying, some testifying, and whatever. Amen. People say, I tell them, don't look at my glory, what God brought me for and say, but hear my story. And I got a story to tell, and I'm not ashamed to go anywhere to tell what the good Lord has done for me. So Jesus said here in the text, he said, whosoever therefore shall be ashamed of me. And not only of who Christ would, what he did, his lifestyle, but what his word says. And I feel one of the setbacks the devil has to do, amen, is to keep the people of God for testifying. Amen. For he said, if I be lifted up, yes, I'll draw all men. It's every time we need to stand up amen. and let the world know, America, God loves you. And he's able, what he's done for me and done for you, he can do for somebody else. Come on. Amen. But we get so, so scared. So nervous. Ooh, thank you, Jesus. And I don't blame Christ. Said uh, he, he's not gonna. Wait, and when he's getting his glory, he's gonna be ashamed of you. Lord have mercy. He ain't saying you ain't gonna get the glory because you're saved. Filled the Holy Ghost, you won't be the glory. And we know there's rewards given in glory. Hello. And I think, uh, Lord, you didn't acknowledge him down here. How you expect him to acknowledge you up there? Yeah. Hello. Oh, can I take my coat off? Can I take my coat off? Yeah, okay. Protocol, dress code. 
you find him, you get out. Amen. And, and, and the thing that's sad to me, I remember years ago, uh, when I did street church, I, I told him many years ago, uh, out in Staten Island, very young, I went to a uh, pastor uh, named Sister Lady Mother, the preacher, a uh, 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 sermon, on uh, Saturday afternoon, you serve. And when they brought me over to the preacher, you serve, and this little small, we call storefront church, you know, small church, you know, where you put 10, 15 people to cry. You know what I'm saying? Look. And when I went there, the project all around. So when I went to the preacher afternoon, sir, I asked the pastor, said, Pastor, it's a summer day and uh, no air condition, if it's possible. Now, I know the last moment, is it possible? And shall nice, lovely children cry, children cry. I said, if it's possible, can we go outside, put the chair on the sidewalk? I'll testify, I'll preach, I'll sing, I'll do everything with you. I'll be a one man back. So I come to help you. But the, me to preach all those children, a few adults there, and the church and, co and people outside the project, I said, I said, I'll give a little orientation. Say, we change the program. We're going outside, and, and I started telling what to do, the street service, how to give a track, how to testify. If you're scared, close your eyes and just testify. You know, and, and one little girl said to me, she said, I don't want to go outside. I said, Why? He said, Them folks gonna hit you side your head. I said, What? Little girl. I said, I tell you what, the pastor, we're going outside. The pastor be here, and you be in the middle with me. Look, girl, and the pastor so we're going out. And we went outside, children cried, put the chairs, and the kids, children began to sing on a Saturday afternoon. And when you put a lot of, a lot of children, the children outside, with the parents get attention, come run and see what's going on. Amen. And when, when we singing and preaching, the little girl was singing with us, and a woman staggered, a young lady, kind of drunk, alcohol. Look at you. And she came and broke the crowd and hugged her daughter. Ah, God, thank you, Jesus. And did you not know when the altar call was saved, that woman got saved because of that daughter we put into the church? And after service, I said, did anybody hit you side your head? She said, no, 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 no. <laughs> you see, the church sometimes are, are scared, nervous. And I, I said everybody should go out in the street. He didn't say that. But he said, go all over the world and preach the gospel. Gospel. God's only son paid all liability. Amen. And sometimes people fear, F-E-A-R, fear is a false evidence at false evidence as real. Hello. Faith is forsaken all. I trust him. Faith is to believe whatever God said will come to pass without seeing. Faith believe wherever you cannot see will come to pass. Fear believe what you cannot see will come to pass. Fear is negative. Faith is possible. Right. Woo, thank you. Yes, and so people don't take the time in your home place, in your job. Because of the, the, the society, people try to cope with society, the dress wear, the acting, try to be like the world, that be in the world, but not of the world. And because of our attitude and dress style, we don't want to be associated with Christ. We, Lord, thank you, Jesus. We, we, Fear to tell what Jesus Christ. I don't mean you have to preach the gospel, but tell your story. Yeah. Amen. That, tell, that's all you need to do is tell your story. And, and just think what Christ has done for the church. Then the church stand up in time. Uh, he didn't deny us. Why should we deny him? And, and, and many years ago, David, in the Old Testament, I'm, I'm not be here all day. Uh, you got an outside church. Psalm 31, David, I love David. David said, Psalm 31 and 1, he said, In thee, O Lord, do I put my trust. Let me never be ashamed. Deliver me in thy righteousness. Amen. And when you look on the word ashamed, from the word shame, the word shame is a, is a negative word. 
uh, Channel 7 have a program set when uh, you, you have a situation in those arms, you go to Channel 7, and there's shame, shame, shame on you. <laughs> Amen. And so what a shame means, it having a feeling of shame or arising from something that's been done. See, so instead of being positive, we get ashamed. Now, I know your husband may not look too good. He, I mean, bald head, big belly. He, amen. Look like a truck hit him or something. And his wife, and, and you just feel ashamed to go out. Shame to go out. Shame to go out. Shame to go out. Go out. Woman. Why? Because you, 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 you know, it, it, it's something. When, but beauty is skin deep. Thank God. Amen. And, and, and when it's time for you to stand up for Jesus, to testify for him, in spite of in spite of situation and trouble, in spite of so you ought to be able to do because he told 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 he